when you did nothing wrong, but life still insists on giving you a one-way ticket to trouble. <laughs> Even the rowdiest kids who hate bedtime have those rare days when they surprise us all by hitting the hay early. This is why you should listen to the experts. Don't overdo the meds. Listen up, docs. I'm here for a health check. Now your cringe butt exploration. How dare you? Before doctor time, give it some light therapy. Though in this case, has a slightly different meaning. Do you think they'll cut this guy some slack? Like, he's practically their in-house floor cleaner already. It's funny how we all turn into geniuses when we face our fears, like we've taken a smart pill or something. Leo, <laughs> Some lazy cats go all out in their workouts just because of a saying, even if it's not about fitness. Hey. Hey, Dylan. <laughs> a real tough warrior gearing up for a fight doesn't need a shield. In this case, it's a bird cage. <laughs> Feelings won't stay hidden because words can lie, but the body spills the beans. With super sniffers, puffs avoid public bathrooms, but this fella prefers them over a doc's appointment any day. Even adventure junkies have their no-go zones, like places with that medical vibe. <laughs> when you're built like a tank, but turn into a marshmallow at the vet's office. He's not a scaredy dog. He's just too stubborn to take orders and all about doing things his way. Out in the real world, he's a man, but in the clinic, he's like a big boy. Just remember, don't tell this to his crush. Humans can win almost any argument, except convincing their dog to go to the vet. That's a battle. You go out to this thing. I don't care. I don't care. This time. This time. We're not going to keep having these problems. What the hell? Whenever you bring your furry friend there, you're basically burning lots of calories. So, pet parents who do this often are bound to stay in shape.
The hospital, where patients show off their Oscar-worthy performances, is like a stage for drama and flair. Cinco de oro. Sabay mai. Hmm. Wadi di. Good thing it was a male owner. If it was a girl, this four-legged goofball might have been a bit too much for her. The floor is kind of wet, so I'll give it a quick wipe down to make it dry, Mom. <laughs> Thinking of family somehow brings peace, so maybe he'll bring his family portrait on the next visit. As long as you get to see your favorite doc, needles and meds ain't nothing to fear. Doc's got hands that can either make us out or ah with their skill. As soon as the nurse hollers, next please, the waterworks mode goes on like magic. I'm just gonna scooch in right here if you don't mind. Uh, Blow drying time is actually the perfect opportunity to practice some impromptu tangle move. Somebody please tell me that what's happening is all just a bad dream? It seems one leg's gone on vacation after that shot. Maybe the biggest divas have to up their game to match this powerhouse of singing. Mom's got the wheel forever even when you're all grown up and have a doc visit. Leave me alone at this point. I'm minding my business. I don't do anything. I don't say anything. Leave me alone, please. Come on, Mom. We're going the wrong way. It's treat o'clock at home. I'm starving. Talk about patience, you've got the quiet types and the ones who turn the place into a scream fest. You ready to go with Petco? Huh? Jump down. Friend. Oh my goodness, that's too funny. You barking at me? Why? Doc, checkups can be scary, but hey, post-exam treats make it worthwhile. And thanks for tuning in.